what do you see as the biggest um, improvement um, from your patients with Parkinson's that they get from regular exercise? Sure. Um, well, I, I think that is a difficult question to answer because I think the benefits from exercise are so profound and they, they hit so many different areas. What I typically tell my patients when they show up to the clinic as I can tell the patients that are exercising and not exercising. I mean, it's, it's that dramatic. Wow, that's so, great. From a purely physical standpoint, um, you know, again, when they walk into the clinic, I can tell a difference. I mean, they're walking better, their balance is better, their, their whole just general outlook on life seems to be better. Um, they're just, they're just coping better in addition to the physical demands. Wow, so just, uh, just through and through, like, like their whole presentation and, and attitude and everything. Yeah, it's just that dramatic. I, so outside of, you know, physical issues, they have seen benefits on patients' quality of life. They've seen benefits on their mood and their outlook. Uh, there's definitely been decreases in anxiety and depression. I think when you've talked in some of our prior presentations, you brought that up. Yes. Uh, it's a definite huge stress reliever. Mm -hmm. And having a chronic disease like Parkinson's disease is, is stressful. Um, yeah. There are benefits on cognition. Uh, there's been a couple of patient papers recently out in our medical literature that have really highlighted that. It helps sleep, which is a huge problem for a lot of my Parkinson's patients. And when you don't sleep well, you don't feel well. So when that, that gets better, that really helps too. So yeah. I, again, I, that's a tough question to answer because I love having talks about exercise because I really do think it helps so many different things and it's hard to pinpoint one specific thing. That's great. Yeah, I mean, it can... Like you said, it can help sleep, which can prevent the cascade. It can help mood. It can help in so many things. And yeah, I've experienced it from a depression standpoint. So uh, that's great to hear. That's really great to hear. And I and I would say, you know, a lot of times we do focus on the physical, but and in, in just purely physical outside of things I just mentioned, I mean, there's a lot of literature out there that would delay disability. Um, people are able to live better lives longer. So you know, when I, I follow a lot of these patients for years and years and years, I mean, we develop our relationships together. And so it's so nice to see people really, you know, fighting their illness and taking care of themselves and, and staying as active as possible. I and mean, that's just, that's great to see. That's awesome.